Hi, this is Bill Myers, and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to answer a question I'm always asked about pan and crop when I show it in these video tips, and that's how to move the pan and crop. And what I've got here is I've got two video clips, and I want to put the top one into the TV screen like I've done in the previous. And to do that, I'll select the pan and crop, which is right there, and that brings it up on the window. And what I always do when I select event pan and crop is I change the zoom so I can see more of the screen. And then I always make sure my preview window is over here. And then now that I can see more of the screen, I can change the size of the vent pan and crop. And the question that a lot of people ask me is, I, you notice that I can move this image around all that I want and moves up and down. And people have asked me, well, why can't they move it up and down on their screen? And the reason they can't is over here, there's an icon right there. And if you click that, you'll notice that on mine it says move freely. If you don't have it set to move freely, you can only move it one side, uh, right or left. Or you may have the vertical, which allows you to move it just vertically. So what you want to do is you want to make sure that's set for the cross, and that's the vertical and horizontal, which gives you move freely. And once you can move it freely, then you can resize it, and you can put it exactly where you want to fill the screen. And then once you've done that, then you'll have the pan and crop that works the way you want it to. Anyway, that's another one of my simple video tips of the week. I'm Bill Myers. You can find more like this at www.bmyers.com.